Welcome to the Love Kingdom. This is Dr. Nelson giving you a word of love. Today, the topic is from the question of one of my clients. He says, when your partner doesn't want to change. When your partner doesn't want to change, what do you have to do? Well, it's very strange that a lot of people are talking about helping your partner change, be a better person in a relationship. It's a good thing really to want change. Because changes means something is growing. If there's no change, it means that there's no growth. So I think you have got the right to really expect your partner to change and be a better lover in your life. If there's no change, of course, what's the point really of continuing to live with someone who is always boring, always angry, always jealousy, and all type of things which are really are making a lot of people really miserable. That's not a good thing to have in your life at all. Now, the thing is, if you are in a relationship because you are coming from different background, you need to learn how really to handle your partner in a loving way. If you can't do that, you are not worthy of that person. So it's very important for you really to expect your partner really to change and be a better lover in your life because you need to have someone to be proud of. So in that, for, for that matter then, every day of your life you need to know how to help your partner be a better person. The thing is, love by its definition is somebody who cares about you. Somebody who is willing to pay the cost of making you a happy person. You know what? Life has got no meaning at all if you're not living a happy life. And your partner is someone who is very close to you, who you always be expecting to be the guy or the girl who will do all he can to make you feel a happy person. This lady who came to my office with this question, she said, Johnny is always making me unhappy. What can I do? You see, when things progressively become bad, Every day you have got something to say which is negative about your partner. Is it a healthy ground to live? So when you are expecting your partner to change certain things which he is doing is not making you happy. Number one, you need to always remember he's a human being, he makes mistakes, but he can learn to be a better person. So once you are in a relationship and your partner says with all his heart, that he loves you or she loves you, then you need to create an environment whereby this person will feel good about doing some changes about his behaviors, his attitudes, and also other things. Now, what you need to do in that particular situation is make him, make her feel free to say what goes on in his heart. Now, when he doesn't want to listen to your pain, to your emotional pain, to your struggles to be loved by this person. He's telling you, I really don't, don't care about you. Well, they might say, I love you, I really love you. But if what they're doing is causing you pain, then they're just deceiving you. They are using you. So you need to know how to challenge your partner to be a better person than what he is today. Because you know, in our life every day we are coming across a lot of different things, different people. So sometimes we learn things which, well, 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 I didn't know about this, but it sounds good. Sometimes you can just learn something from watching a movie. Something beautiful. And you have to implement this one into relationship. And therefore, you need to help your partner see the value of the changes you want him or her to make. If he doesn't see the value of making the changes you need, then you will always cry, try to push him, and then you push him away. Now, ground number one, you always need to make him feel comfortable about what you want to talk to him, about the changes you need. So he should feel safe and not judged. You know, you know, you can tell somebody, I don't want this, and he can understand and stop doing whatever he has been doing. But if he feels judged, as if he's a rotten tomato, he will always be very cross, very angry. You know, sometimes people, when they are told to change something in their life, they feel they want to be controlled. And that's all, always will bring some resistance. So help your partner to see that well, you're not saying what you're saying about your need for changes because you just want to control him because you want him to be a better lover. And this will be able to bring very good results if you yourself 
have been showing enough effort to love him the way he wants to be loved. You know what? You can say to, you can say to somebody, I love you. But if you don't know how he expects you to love you, to love him, 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 or her, you will always struggle to love. For example, I was some one man one man said, Well, I'm trying to wash everything to do help in the in the house. But my, my, my wife doesn't really appreciate that. Why? Because according to her, according to his wife, going out with a husband, being seen with a husband is something she really treasures because in the background, her father used to do that to her mother. You see, so that background, of course, she values going out, being seen with her husband in the streets. She's, she's proud of her husband. So in, 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 if you, are, you want changes in your, in, in your relationship, try to understand why she wants change, why he wants change, and what been a benefit. Now, if you can do that, you can help your partner see why you want changes, and she will make the effort to do so. Number three, you need to understand your, 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 your partner, of course, uh, is a human being. Sometimes he might be stressed and really misinterpret what you're saying. So you need to choose the right time to help your partner see the value of making the changes you're asking. Don't ask him when he's stressed. Don't ask her when she really has got a lot in her mind going on, whether it's from work or whatever it is, or studies. So choose a moment whereby you can talk in a very smooth way. So do that, you'll be causing resistance. Now, pain is not a good thing. Nobody wants, wants pain. So what you need to do, if your partner, you've, you've tried all that you can think about, I've tried all can to help my, my, my partner understand where my heart is coming from, where I get hurt easily. And he, if he doesn't listen, if he does try to make effort to change, then he's, t he's telling you, I really don't love you anymore. Now, it reaches a stage where you ask yourself, why should I continue to relate this? When you reach that stage, let your partner know that you've reached that stage. Because now, for you just to pretend as if everything is okay, when it, nothing is okay, it will poison your life. So, once you reach a stage where we say, well, how long will I tolerate this? Just tell him, let me know. If he really, oh, if she really cares about you, she needs to know you've reached a point whereby if you turn to the left, you will never come back. So she needs to know that but you are about to lose me. You know what? If somebody loves you, he will always try to keep you happy. Not only so, he will always want to keep you happy, but to be a part of his life. If somebody really is not making enough effort to keep you, then he's, he's not worthy of you. So, if he leaves because, well, I can no longer really tolerate this, if he leaves, it's okay. He has a right to choose either to stay with you or for you to leave him. Now, a lot of people are afraid of losing a partner. A lot of people are afraid of that because they don't value themselves enough to fight for the right to be happy. When your partner refuses to change. The message is, is giving you, I don't care about you. Now, how can you live with somebody who doesn't care about you? How and why? So, take steps to help your partner see the value of him or her making the right changes for your benefit. Well, you can send me my question. My email is down there. Please just write to me and then it will be a subject for the next video. God bless you.